what we have here at uh, Eurosatri this year uh, is we have a cooperation bet between three uh, different entities within BA. Uh, we're using the digital backbone of the CV90 together with the Lemur from Beaufort and the Q-Site system from, uh, taken from uh, aircraft down to land systems now. What it makes us do is we're actually designing a system that we call an intelligent system awareness system, which actually enhances the situation awareness for the, for the soldier inside the vehicle. So you actually have the, what we call the Q-Site from Electronic Solutions. This is taken from the Apache helicopter, taken down to our combat vehicles in terms of robustness and, and, and such. It's coupled to a head tracking system, which you have in the vehicle. It also works head up out of the vehicle, but then you have uh, inertial uh, sensors instead. And what it does is, this is actually like any ordinary screen in the vehicle. So you can project any video you'd like to have. In this case, we have the sight system from uh, the sights from uh, the Lemur coupled to this. So you actually, this is what you will see through this screen, and it's a see-through screen, so you can actually focus behind it if you'd like to. So if I take this control and I point this helmet on, you can actually see. The, the Lemur catching on. So it gives uh, the commander a, a great opportunity to slew and, and, and um, point in the gunner into the right direction if he sees a threat in an in interesting spot. Just a, a way to enhance the situation awareness for the crew. Uh, so, uh, if now we're inside the vehicle and uh, we have the same system as displayed on the outside where we could actually steer the, the weapon station. Uh, but what we could also do inside here is what we call the see-through armor with this type of technology. We have a 360 degree camera system on, on the vehicle which has an algorithm which makes it uh, seamless. So you can actually look around the vehicle and you do that by just turning your head. And you'll, in this display, which is like in any other color display, you will see that as you would on, a, on, a, on the video or on, or on an ordinary screen, which, are, which we have here. So, take one of these tablets down. So what you see in that, this is a recording from an, uh, to go, going in the terrain, running in the terrain with the vehicle. Just by turning your head, you will see this 360 view. So look into the front, you would actually see where the, where the vehicle is going. Also in this, we take in BMS data. So for instance, you, you can see where your friendlies or foes are if you have that. Here you have uh, a friend, for instance. The size of the symbols actually tells you how far away they are, so on. And just, uh, just an example of what you can do. This also means that the soldiers in the squad compartment now can contribute to the situation awareness of the platform in a whole other way than they used to. Um, I remember myself sitting in one of these, sleeping, going from point A to point B. Now you can actually do some good by keeping track of what's going on on the outside. Another feature which we, we are adding in is 3D, uh, 3D map data. So, for instance, what that gives you, what capability gives you is, for instance, that the commander can take, ask the driver to take me from point A to point B without being seen from point C. Since you have that 3D map data, the terrain data, when the driver, who has a similar system as this helmet, when he's looking out, he will see where the shadow line is, where he will not be seen from the point C. So it certainly contributes to the sa safety of the soldiers and, and the survivability of the platform. So that's what we call the intelligent situation awareness system. Everybody can contribute. Uh, you have more eyes out there. You have heads-up display, you do not need as a commander to constantly look down at your map 
you will have it here. Uh, and uh, you can salute the queue with the gun and so on. There's a million of opportunities, what you can do with a modern electronic architecture.